The trucks arrive, up to 500 a night, bringing in the freshest produce from across Australia. The market businesses begin setting up their stalls as they have every weekday since 1975. Each day, Monday to Friday, the markets open and the bargaining begins, as around 6,000 customers enter the markets to trade in Australia's most diverse range of quality fresh fruit, vegetables and flowers. This is Sydney Markets, home of fresh food, flowers and patties. The fresh produce sold through Sydney Markets is consumed by almost one third of Australia's population. Sydney Markets is an institution, one of the largest privately owned markets in the world. So large, it has its own postcode. As the premier fresh produce and flower market of Australia, Sydney Markets is famous for being as cosmopolitan as the city it serves. This is the story of Sydney Markets, the marketplace in the heart of Sydney that Sydney has taken to its heart. To appreciate the significance of Sydney markets, you need to know the origins of Sydney itself, as the markets can be seen as a chronicle of the times that began way back in 1788. The government, convict and settler farmers brought with them the livestock, produce, and the building blocks for what would become Australia's first agricultural industry, and had to produce fruit and vegetables to sustain the colony. This gave birth to a makeshift produce market that in the 1800s moved to the streets of Sydney and officially launched as the Sydney Markets. Over the next 200 years, Sydney Markets grew in size and influence and relocated to larger premises throughout Sydney a number of times and then divided its produce categories that traded at different times of the week and Sydney Market continues this practice to this very day. Here is Sydney Markets, 43 hectares of one of the most operationally efficient and well-constructed markets in the world. Sydney Markets Limited is an unlisted public company owned by approximately 2,000 shareholders, all of whom have trading space in the market. A management team and support staff of 75 run the daily market operations. The company's board of directors consists of nine members, with five representing the different market categories, and two expertise and two independent directors. The Sydney Markets comprises of five distinct market brands. The Sydney Produce Market caters mainly to professional buyers from supermarkets, restaurants, independent greengrocers, the hospitality and catering trade, and is home to around 120 fresh produce wholesalers. The Sydney Growers Market is Australia's largest growers market with around 400 stands, selling a vast array of fresh produce. The Sydney Flower Markets trades six days a week from 5am and is home to over 116 flower growers and wholesalers and accounts for around 75% of the wholesale cut flower trade in New South Wales. This represents more than 50% of the total cut flower trade for the whole of Australia. As business comes to a close on Friday morning, Sydney markets loosen up for the weekend and transform to become Sydney's Paddy's Markets, the most recognised brand and the most successful retail markets in Australia. Sydney's Paddy's Markets is a community celebration of bargain shopping. Every week, 250,000 people flock to Paddy's Markets at Flemington and to our city location at Haymarket. Paddy's Markets at Haymarket is in close proximity to Sydney's Showcase, the most beautiful harbour in the world and is an iconic tourist shopping destination. Sydney is a vibrant cosmopolitan capital that regularly ranks among the world's most livable cities with a population just over 5.2 million. Sydney has one of the lowest city population densities and highest standards of living in the world. This high standard is directly related to the quality, diversity and freshness of the city's produce, which leads us back to Sydney Markets, the largest produce markets in the Southern Hemisphere. It's worth looking at other factors of our location to understand further why Sydney Markets draws customers not just from Sydney, but from all over Australia. Sydney Markets is located halfway between the Sydney CBD and Parramatta, which is New South Wales' next largest city on a major highway that links the two. 
This places us at the epicenter of millions of business and commuter movements daily, and all of Sydney's motorways and major highways can lead you to the markets. This extensive road access is necessary, as the markets field over 70,000 vehicle movements per week, and at any given weeknight, up to 500 trucks can be unloading. We also have a railway station next door that brings people in their thousands to the markets. Let's go behind the scenes to get a sense of the logistics and sheer dimension of the operation. The everyday working statistics of Sydney markets can be overwhelming when you first hear them. We operate seven days a week, 24 hours a day, with over 6,000 people employed on site. Over 2.5 million tonnes of fresh produce is traded annually, which equates to around $3.5 billion turnover. Over 20,000 growers throughout Australia contribute to the markets, and there are 2,000 regular traders operating on site. The site caters for over 250,000 cubic metres of cool rooms and 1,000 forklifts. Approximately 23 Sydney market traders are engaged in export. Exports from Sydney markets are estimated at 60,000 tonnes per annum, of which 45,000 tonnes are delivered by air freight, mainly to Asia. This makes up 67% of New South Wales' total fresh produce exports, or 7.5% of the total exports out of Australia. Exporting is an ever-growing segment of the Sydney markets trade, which is set to accelerate as we come closer to the completion of the dedicated agribusiness precinct within the Badgerys Creek Aerotropolis. The Aerotropolis is located 47 kilometres from Sydney markets. The M4 motorway connects the future airport with the Eastern Creek Distribution Hub, the City of Parramatta and the market site at Homebush West while the newly completed West Connex Motorway completes the journey to Paddy's Market's Haymarket in the Sydney CBD. Turning to the layout of the markets, buildings A, B, C and E are the Sydney produce markets. Building E is unique in that it exclusively sells only wholesale bananas. It can handle in excess of 160,000 boxes every day. Building D houses the Sydney Growers Market in an area equivalent to three football fields under cover. Building D is also the home of Sydney's Paddy's Markets from Friday to Sunday. Building F is home to our very successful Sydney Flower Market. In fresh cut flowers alone, the annual turnover is well in excess of $200 million. In addition to this, the site provides over 70,000 square metres of on-site warehouse space and two multi-storey car parks. The Sydney Markets Plaza is a multi-storey building consisting of ground floor retail premises and two levels of commercial offices. Over 150 supporting businesses are also on site and that includes banks, a post office, cafes, a chemist and a medical centre providing essential services to the Sydney Markets community. Commercial premises are also incorporated into new buildings like the 2,000 square metres of office space in Warehouse Z. This support extends to the market having its own credit cooperative. The traders traditionally traded in cash, but they needed a more secure system. Established in 1991, the credit co-op allows buyers and wholesalers to settle their accounts on site. A progressive idea and a convenient, safer system for all. Sydney Markets is committed to its environmental sustainability program and has set stringent environmental targets. Greenpoint is the market's purpose-built waste management facility for sorting, separating and managing waste. Over the past three years, it has sent in excess of 10,000 tonnes of organic waste to an anaerobic digestion facility and a bioreactor to be converted into energy which is then sold to an electricity provider. As well as recycling over 4,500 tonnes of cardboard, it has recycled over 400,000 timber pallets into wood chip for landscaping and collected and recycled the 60 tonnes of steel. 170 tonnes of plastics and polystyrene products have also been recycled into building products and other items. In all, up to 70% of the total waste is now recycled each year. 
Sydney Markets is also leading the way in renewable resources with over 8,600 solar panels installed at Flemington, generating around 11% of the site's needs, which is equivalent to powering 1,300 homes. We also have rainwater collection facilities that allow the sustainable cleaning of the markets and reduce the impact of freshwater supplies. Marketing plays an important role in keeping the Sydney Markets brand active, as well as successful marketing initiatives undertaken by Sydney's Paddy's Markets, Sydney Markets also conducts two other major marketing programs, Fresh for Kids and the Fresh Awards. The Fresh for Kids program is aimed at combating the rising levels of obesity in primary age school children by encouraging them to eat plenty of fresh fruit and vegetables and do more exercise. Sydney Market's Fresh Awards are a platform for encouraging and recognising best practice and innovations in fresh produce and flower growing and retailing. The Fresh Awards consist of six categories, including Greengrocer Awards, Florist Awards, Wholesaler of the Year, Produce Grower of the Year, Flower Grower of the Year and Fresh Blogger of the Year. City Markets, the name, is synonymous with quality fresh produce, beautiful flowers and community market bargains. We're proud of the excellent quality of our fresh produce and we aim to continually improve the service and facilities that we provide for our stakeholders and our customers. We believe Sydney Markets is the most effective privately operated market in the world and we've had over 200 years to get it just right. Sydney Markets, the home of fresh food, flowers and patties.